Hello everyone and you're welcome to GBFM for today tutorial and I'm with Jirole Mojibola. Today we are going to be making a casual sandal for men. I've actually worked on the edges. I'll be showing us later in the class. Now I'm going to be showing us how to last this kind of slide that is majorly for men. Sit back and I'll be right back. Now for our men's casual genuine leather sander we are going to be making use of strap we are going to be doubling the strap now as you can see i've already created the strap i've taught us in one of the videos on how to create our hopper so i would suggest if you don't understand how i created this one i would suggest you watch the video and also i taught us about how we can finish the edges of our strap as you can see I finished these edges you can see the way they are shining so you can also learn that so that you'll be able to produce a professionally looking casual sander now the first the next thing we I'm going is I'm going to be placing my hand for those who are familiar with my class you know I like to use my hand because I know your hand will always be available for you to use now the points I'm going to be using for this particular main casual sander is i'm going to be using this side of my finger i'm going to be using this side and then i'm going to be using in between this particular finger so i'm just going to trace that down and i'm going to use that don't forget always ensure it is one centimeter away from the edge so that it doesn't cut off now the first strap i'm going to be placing is my 1.5 centimeter wide strap now one of the reasons why um, according is particularly is our design the design has a, a smaller is a, a 1.5 centimeter strap and then the other one is about three centimeter wide now your, the length of your strap is going to be determined by your size the size i'm making is size 45 now i made use of three centimeter here and 1.5 centimeter here now what am i going to do i'm going to place it on it now the two of them are going to go into the same opening so definitely they have to be on themselves so i'm going to mark the lower part ensure that it covers the upper but as you can see you can see the, the, the this is the first one i make sure it's, it covers it then go ahead to pick up the side so that is what i'm going to do now i'm just going to use my my punch plier you can make use of a punch to do that it doesn't necessarily have to be a punch plier so i'm going to open this i'll open this with a utility knife now as you can see i've opened up the side and i've opened up the other side too you can see that it's perfectly fitted i'm not having excess that is what happened when you ensure that you place before you you open it up i mean before you do the second measurement ensure that you place it on the first the first point you pick and make sure that when you are picking the next one too you pick you make sure it's under not directly at the point where it stops so that it will not be having excess now for the lower part of our casual men's sander we are going to be making use of this side i'm going to make use of 7.5 centimeter or you can decide to place your hand this way although you know that each of us has a much more wider wider palm so for me if i put my hand like this i'm just going to make use of that particular side and then this particular side as well but if you want to measure you can decide to measure 7.5 or eight centimeter i mean from this side to this side you can measure 8.5 or 7.5 it depends on what you want and as for this design you will find out that it has a lesser space on this side it didn't go in if you want your home to go in inward and you don't want it to come as much as this side you can decide to make it nine centimeter from here to this side then you measure it upward i mean now as you can see this now i'm going to place this like this on top of it and I'm going to also place this this way. So this is on top of this one. And this one will be on it as well. And then I will pick my points under it. I'm just going to pick it under here. So this is just going to be my measurement. Then I'm just going to punch and open just like I did to this particular one. 
now for the second leg what i'm just going to do is i'm going to place the first one that i cut on it as usual and then i'm going to mark those points out so you don't have to go ahead and be taking another kind of measurement again yes see what we have after lacing our shoe so many people have asked me about this the width of straps when it comes to making this kind of a men casual sander i want to believe that you can decide you can decide on whatever width you want to work with your width can be wider than mine if you want it to be wider and it can be smaller but i think this is perfectly okay because this together is just 4.5 centimeter so i want to believe with this tutorial you should be able to make a casual genuine leather sander that a man can wear even the amazing thing is that you can even make it for a woman but you all all you need to do is just to change the outer so and the inner so because the shape of the men you know leg and feet or so to say is much more different from the women thank you so much for watching to this tutorial don't forget to subscribe if you're watching for the first time i'll see you next time bye